What if the emergencies pilots train for are far worse than anything they'll ever see in real life? Because before they ever fly you with passengers, they must survive scenarios designed to break them. Every airline pilot must pass a full motion simulator check every six months, called the LPC or OPC. And the regulator approved emergencies are brutal engine failure at takeoff, hydraulic loss, electrical faults, rapid depressurization, all thrown at you back to back. Most pilots will go their entire career without a real engine failure, but the simulator gives them one almost every session. They train wind shear escapes, high speed rejected takeoffs, severe turbulence and stall recovery, all under pressure. If a pilot fails even one element, they're immediately grounded until retrained. The sim is deliberately harder than reality. So when something does happen in the real world, it feels easier by comparison. So tell me, does this make you feel safer, knowing pilots train for the absolute worst? Or does it surprise you how much pressure they face behind the scenes? Is intense simulator training essential, or too extreme? Where do you stand?